All right, Sketch Pad Podcast, we back. Make sure you like, share, subscribe to the page. So today, we're going to uh, have a conversation about something that a female said on her Instagram about women shouldn't have kids with men. So, we'll be back. Who raised you? was crazy oh my god uh, children are too young to make those type of choices for themselves you know that's why they have parents oh eat each other what yo i can't understand it neither i'm just ahead of it all right yeah me we back so look is it recording wait here it is so look before we get into that Make sure you like, share, subscribe. The uh, if you want to donate, links in the description, cash at PayPal, all that good stuff. So we are gonna watch this little short little clip, and we are gonna come back and discuss what she has to say. And is it some type of validity to what she's saying? I don't know, but we are gonna go for it. Let's go. Let me give y'all a hot take. Maybe an unpopular opinion that people are not gonna really understand when I first say it. Okay, don't let these men get you pregnant. Because a lot of times they try to get you pregnant to lower you and to humble you and to stop your bag. Because if he really valued you and he really wanted you, he would marry you, not just get you pregnant. I'm telling y'all, do not let these males get you pregnant. Because a lot of times they only do it to have constant access to you as a baby mother, to keep you around in their life without no real commitment, and they try to do it to, to stop your bag. A lot of men try to baby mama y'all just to stop y'all from doing what y'all was doing before. They try to slow you down by getting you pregnant. Let me get... Ooh. <laughs> Oh, man, I got so much to say to this. <laughs> listen, man. Listen, listen, this. Oh, my God. This is the type of female that ruins societies. I'm sorry to tell y'all. These type of opinions. First of all. It's not only men that get you pregnant it's you having unprotected sex unprotected sex with the man that gets you pregnant do you see how she totally took the responsibility off of the woman and put it all on the man what kills me about women like this is they always say my body my choice right they support that a hundred percent. But then when it comes to children or having a baby, all of a sudden now, don't let these men get you pregnant. As if men just walk around and touch a girl and get her pregnant. She made it seem like it's so easy for a man to get a woman pregnant. In a sexual act, it's easy. But to get to that point is very difficult for a man. So, of course, you're having sex if you're having unprotected sex. It's very possible that you can get pregnant, right? Yeah, of course, we know that. But the way she was saying it, she's saying it as if, like, it's a cold. Like, if you don't wear a mask, <laughs> you might catch the cold, the pregnant cold. It's like, Really? And then I see how she tried to slide the marriage thing in there. Don't let these men get you pregnant. Because if they're not going to marry you, don't let them get you pregnant. How about don't get pregnant until you're married? But her, but here's the best part. She said that the only reason why men want to get you pregnant is to humble you. <laughs> As if a baby is a burden right to humble you and stop you from getting your bag so there's a lot of women out there who are not getting a bag 
And there's a lot of women who need to be humbled. So it's just, it, it kills me the dynamic of women like this who get, who gets a platform and act as if what they're saying is gospel. It's not. And I would love to talk to somebody like this woman. I would love to have her on this show so I can talk to her about her mentality on what she's talking about. Because what she's spewing is a bunch of garbage. But go ahead, man. First of all, right. The way she's even presenting herself with this whole topic is way off. Is way off. First off, ladies, do not listen to this woman, okay? Don't listen to her. If you listening to her, then you belong in the same bracket as her. Don't listen to her. That's one. Two, two, right? If you're dealing with a guy like that, then you probably are going to be faced with those issues, but the thing is, it's probably your fault too. It takes two to tangle. You can't go take the responsibility of what the woman did and put it all on the guy like the guy just did everything by himself. A woman has to agree to it, right? A woman has to say, yes, come over, let's spend time, let's do this, let's do that. You know what I mean? If the woman don't agree to it, nine times out of 10, it's gonna be called something else. And I don't even wanna say that word, but you know what I'm talking about. So what I'm saying is, right, if you've been in that position, nine times out of 10, it's both of y'all's fault. It's not just the man's fault, it's your fault too. So you gotta take equal responsibility because you decide to lay down with the dirt bag. So. There you have it. Lastly, right? Lastly, I agree. Marriage, value the person, I agree with that. But the whole way she slid that in, nah, the t that shouldn't even be in what you was discussing. That shouldn't even be put in there because you try to, you, you know that you was gonna get backlash for probably what you saying because of how you presenting it. So, oh yeah, let me slide the marriage thing in there real quick. <laughs> so then that way, so that way no one says, oh, well, what about this? And what about that? Nah, 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 nah. We peep that. We peep what you was trying to do. No, the marriage thing shouldn't even be put in there because the way I see it, ain't nobody thinking about marriage. If they're, the, if they're doing this type of stuff on the side, they're not thinking about marriage. Nobody thinking about marriage if you got a guy and a female who are getting together and hooking up and then they get pregnant and then a the guy wants to do, they ain't thinking about marriage. So how is marriage even put in there in the first place? Marriage is its own bracket. It's in its own category. Don't put marriage in there just to, oh, make, make like, oh, let me slide that in there so I can get people on my side. Nah, don't do that. Don't do that. You're wrong for that. Marriage don't even belong in there. If a guy's marrying you, yes, he values you straight like that. Don't put it in there because it don't belong. The two don't belong together. You understand? But man, she bugging, man. She she's probably single herself. She probably single herself, getting her bag with no man, with mm -hmm. no man, no responsibilities of a relationship, no children. Yeah, go get your bag and go end up being 50 or 60 years old with no husband, no children, no nothing, and be by yourself. And, and, and you're absolutely right. The, the, the crazy thing is she sat there and said that, and she don't put no ownership on women, especially when it comes to the marriage thing. So you basically tell them women to get married to a man who really don't love them. Because yeah. it takes time for that. It's like, oh, if he ain't going to marry you, then why would you have his baby? Okay, we all get that. We get that. We, again, you try to be slick with it. We get it. But 
that's not the case because you only telling her to marry him or to make sure he marry her. Well, you he can't really make sure he marry her. But the only reason why you're saying make sure y'all get married is because of security and because she's going to lose out on her bag. That's it. You're not telling her to marry him because she love him. You said, nope. and you ain't say nothing positive in that whole message. Everything was nope. all negative. She could at least said, you know what? Just make sure, ladies, just make sure the guy you get pregnant by, make sure he's he's worth it. You don't want to get pregnant by a baby dad. She said, don't get pregnant by these men because they trying to stop your bag. <laughs> <laughs> they trying to stop your bag? Like men say, you know what? I'm going to get you pregnant so you can't make no more money. Like, <sighs> man, I don't know, man. Listen, man. And, and, and the thing about it is that, you know, like, there are guys out there like that, but she's making it seem as if, like, every single person on the universe is like that. No. If you are hooking up with guys like that, then it's just as much as your fault as it is the guy's fault. And that's the problem, woman like her, because she's probably been involved with guys exactly like that. So now you're trying to translate how you feel, your emotions and everything on everybody else and try to tell people what they think, what you think that they should do because you experienced it yourself. No. It's... Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. No, 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 it's it's your it's, it's your fault just as much as the guy's fault. Don't go don't go try to put it all on the guy. You take responsibility too. It's the, it's it's this whole protection thing that these women got. They they want to protect the hoes. And it's like, no. A lot of a lot of women out here are promiscuous and they're whores. They're whores and they're hoes. And they're promiscuous and they like to they like to have sex with multiple men. And some of them get pregnant and don't know who's the baby dad. So I love how they sell, how she sits there and says, don't let these men get you pregnant, but not say protect yourself and don't get pregnant. It's like men run around and just try to get women pregnant because they want to stop her bag and humble her. It's like, Hey man, listen, man, we out of here, man. <laughs> Makes me so mad every time I see stupid videos like that.